อยู่ไปแจ้งบอกที่บริเวณโต๊ะจุดลงทะเบียนได้เลยและตอนนี้ค่ะสำหรับที่ต่อมาพร้อมแล้วนะคะสำหรับน้องๆจากโรงเรียนมัธยมตากสินระยององค์การบริหารส่วนจังหวัดระยองค่ะกับละครที่มีชื่อว่าพรสามประการจะเป็นไงบ้างนั้นเชิญชมได้เลยค่ะเ
is going back tonight from her school trip. Be nice to each other and don't wait up for me anymore. And remember, please do not enter this door. Understand? Yes, mom. <laughs> The door. Aren't you all curious? Mrs. Johnson doesn't want the kids to open this. Why? There are so many doors in this house. Why protect only this door? Maybe the super recipe of the famous Sum Tam is inside. Well, let's go back to our story. Hello, guys. How's it going? Tom Day and Squire is host. Cindy, no, Sam, please stop being mean, Sam. Are you okay? It's all right. I'm okay, Cody. How about I fix you dinner? How can I relax, huh? Tell me, I was rejected again. Rejection after rejection. I'm so tired of all this. What is missing? What do I need to do so that they will take me in? We are very sorry about that, Cindy. You can always try next year. There is no way. I'm going to that ridiculous team. There is no way. Oh, you mean you're no longer interested in volleyball and being the part of the school team? Mm, I don't know. I'm not sure anymore. Maybe they're right, but they say about me is right all along. Hey, hey, stop! Don't ever let them in. If they say you are a loser, then by giving up, then you're a loser. Show them that you aren't giving up, sister. She enough. Try the verbal to God. Easy for you to say you oozing with confidence. Then off you go. Guys, get away from him! Oh, I'm not here to hurt anyone. Actually, I'm here to give you three wishes. Wait, wishes? You mean you are genie? Wasn't it obvious? Where? I'm a genie, and you are my master. 
However, since you are twins, then whatever you wish for will happen to the other two. Let's say it's a package deal, a new role in our International Genie Association, which put call. That is freaking awesome! This is my chance. I get to change the way we are. Okay, then we're ready for our first wish. Hold on, Ari. I don't think we to talk about this. We can finally see Dad. Cody, that is a long shot. Mom said he's going back, so might as well we wait. Okay? Yes, we're ready to wish. I wish that you make us a new body, more beautiful, lighter skin, smarter, mm, sexier version of ourselves. Better body that we could plan at school and everyone will be jealous. Ooh, I like that. Your wish is my command. Inside this door, it's your new body. Have fun, guys. What the hell feeling about this? How about you? Are you going to wish better life for your family? A perfect home, cars, and money. What, what do you mean? Technically, you are my master too. You touch the master and the pencil all at the same time. That means two wishes for the twin and one for you. I, I don't know. I think the guy that does all this. If I were you. That's just faster, alright? So call me when you need me. He has a new life somewhere. Do you think he's still alive? I don't know, but I have strong feeling that he might still be alive. But what is all this? Sam explained everything to Mrs. Johnson, how they found the genie name Victor, and how the kids got the new version of their bodies. Mrs. Johnson couldn't believe all of it and insisted on calling the police or anyone else to make sense of all this. Sam told them that she had a plan and they should trust her. Mrs. Johnson agreed. Well, let's go back to our story. Mom, you love me the most, right? Mom, don't listen to her. Do you mom! Don't listen to her. Oh, but mom! Both of you stop! I love you both. 
I could never choose between you. Whatever this is, we're gonna pick this as a family. Remember what I told you about family? Oh, I don't need family. I can't be great on my own. I don't need the two of you in my life anymore. You would just delay my greatness. I know what to wish now. Victor, come here, please. Victor, 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 I'm ready for my wish. You, you are the reason why my kids are like this. Master, are you ready for your wish now? Yes, I wish to do undo all the magic you brought to this house. Are you sure about that? You are going to lose everything. Yes. Well then, I hope you're happy with that. Your wish is my command. to be under this house, right? Why we still have this house? If this is the part of the wish of my husband, then why are they still here? I, I don't know, Mrs. Johnson. Magic is very complicated. This is no longer part of the magic. I get it now. We don't need the things we want. All we need is perseverance and the right attitude in life to reach our goals without affecting anyone along the way. David? Is that you? Susie, it's me. Oh my, it's you. What happened? Why did you go? I searched for you everywhere. Mom, you're scaring us. What is going on? Kids, here's your dad. <gasps> Are these the twins? Oh, last thing I remember, you were just babies. Dad, is it really you? Yes, it is. Forgive me for leaving you all these years. The previous year, named Victoria convinced me somehow that I should let her go and use my last wish to free her. I didn't know in return I had to replace her to be the next genie. You mean you're Victor? Yes. Thank you for your selfless wish, Sam. I can be with my family again. Keep me inside a pocket of your red jeans Holding me close until our eyes meet You won't ever be alone Wait for me to come home So there you have it The Johnsons were united once again Thanks to the selfless wish of Sam I hope you learned from our story today Before anything else I will leave you with this If you have a chance to be the next master Of the Mortan Castle What would you wish for? In life, we are going to be tricked to want or desire things that we don't actually need. We are going, going to be, to be tempted, tempted to do, do the, the quick, quick fix to solve, solve our problems. Our story taught us the value of believing in oneself and our ability to rise above any situation. Trust your own abilities. Be content with whatever you have, no matter how much we have. Nurture it and share it to others. Don't ever be scared of who you are. Play your own role in life. If you are too busy playing the roles of others, then who's gonna play you? Carry your life with patience, perseverance, and ethics, and try our best to live by our late king, who we call Philosophy of sufficiency economy. 
Ladies and gentlemen, life is not perfect, it's how you deal with it. Keep me inside the pocket of your ribbed jeans, holding me close until our eyes meet. You won't ever be alone. Wait, Wait for.